Hello and welcome back to Simple Tech Reviews. Today we'll be looking at the Hivision HM136 Baby Monitor. The HM136 is a closed circuit wireless video baby monitor. This means that it does not require a Wi-Fi connection so it is secured from online intrusions. It shows a clear HD video signal up to 1000 feet on its 5 inch screen. It can be panned and rotated from the control monitor and used as a two-way intercom. It has infrared night vision, sound and temperature alerts, has a feeding time reminder, and can even play lullabies. Let's begin with the unboxing. We first see a satisfaction card, then there's the user manual, then we have the camera unit, next is the wireless video monitor, next we see two micro USB cables, one for the camera and the other for the monitor. We then have two wall charging plugs, an adjustable wall mounting bracket, and some pegs and screws. Having a closer look at the camera, on the front we see the light sensor, the 110 degree 720p HD lens, two infrared lights for night vision, the motorized base, and the microphone. On the back we can see the two wireless antennas for a coverage of up to 1000 feet. Then there's the pair button, the USB power port, the temperature sensor which will trigger if the temperature is below 59 degrees or higher than 86, and on the bottom we have the tripod mount and the speaker. Looking now at the monitor, on the front we can see the 5 inch color HD screen, the buttons for back and menu, camera switch which can be used with up to 4 total cameras, the directional keys, the OK button, volume and brightness, the intercom button, the microphone, a sound level meter, and two charge LED lights. On top we can see the extendable antenna and the power button, and on the back we have the speaker and the handy extendable stand. To use the baby monitor, first place the camera where it can provide the best view. Connect the USB power cable to the camera, extend the monitor's antenna and turn it on, and within seconds you will be able to see the live view. When fully charged, the monitor's battery can last up to 5 hours of use. On the screen stop row, you will have important information at a glance such as the signal strength, the camera number, the date and time, sound alerts, sleep mode, the temperature, and the monitor's battery level. You can use the directional keys to move the camera left, right, up and down, Pressing the OK button will provide an instant zoom. Holding down the intercom button will allow you to use the two-way audio function. If you click the volume brightness key, you will be able to change both settings by pressing the directional keys. And you can press the menu button to configure the camera settings. Here you can connect or disconnect your cameras, change the sound detection sensitivity, enable or disable the temperature sensor, change the language, play five different lullabies or loop them, activate the sleep mode which will power off the display to save battery life, enable feeding reminders, and enter into the settings where you can change the date and time, reset the factory settings, and view the contact support information. In conclusion, the Heimvision HM136 is a great video baby monitor with many modern features. It will display a full color HD video during the day and clear infrared vision at night. It has a two-way audio intercom system that allows you to listen and talk. It has sound, temperature and feeding alarms to ensure complete safety of your baby. You can add up to four cameras on a single monitor and its secure closed video circuit will allow you the freedom to move around up to 1000 feet all while keeping you and your loved ones safe and off the grid. If you'd like to check out the High Vision HM136, don't forget to click the link provided below. You will also find the link to purchase additional cameras if you should need them. Thank you very much for watching and if you like this video please consider subscribing, leaving a thumbs up and sharing. Up next are a few quick samples of the monitor in use. I'll see you on our next review.